Hey guys, I am back with another video and today I am going to be giving you this pretty simple makeup look using some products from New Evolution. You guys know I've mentioned them on my channel before. I will link some of the videos up in the cards so you guys can check it out. But I have talked about them before. I do love their product, especially like their foundation and their, uh, like a lot of their skin products, foundation, powder foundation, things like that. So I do feature some of that. Um, a couple of their eyeshadows, their mascara, which is new to me. Um, so I'm in a lip gloss. They have, I have three lip glosses but I just use one obviously for this particular video um, but I do like their lip glosses they are non sticky at all just wanted to mention that right now but I want to show you how I got this real easy light weight I did not use I used you'll see what I did in the video but I didn't use a foundation but I kind of used the foundation to spot conceal which you guys will see in the video and I just use the pressed powder foundation for my complexion so I really wanted to show you guys how I got this look because I'm loving it I wasn't sure if the foundation was going to be full coverage or not but she's giving me full full coverage I love it so yeah, if you guys want to see how I got this very easy, simple, pretty look using some products from New Evolution, definitely stay tuned and yeah, let's hop into the video guys. So I'm just going to show you guys a small snippet of me filling in my brows. I'm using the eyeshadow from New Evolution Chocolate Mousse to fill in my brows, which I have not used powder to fill in my brows in a long time. And I forgot how much I actually really, really liked it. And I do clean my brows up off, off camera, but if you guys want a full brow routine, I will have that linked in the cards of like my go-to brow routine. Next I'm going to go in with some concealer which I'm going to be doing my highlights kind of underneath my foundation um, and I'm just going to go in and apply that underneath my eyes and over my eyelids just to get rid of any discoloration um, and I'm just going to blend it out with a damp beauty blender. I forgot the concealer that I'm using. I believe it's the Colourpop one but I will have it linked down in the description box for you guys to check out um, if you are interested as well. Powder. This is the Black Radiance Setting Powder in Medium. And I'm just going to use that to set that under eye concealer and also my lids just to make sure that it does not crease. Even though I'm not using a lot of eyeshadow today, um, I did want to apply that on top as well. Next, I'm going to go in with the New Evolution Complete Coverage Foundation. This is in the shade 104, which is literally my identical match. Um, it's just the perfect match for me. Like, it literally just blends in and looks super bomb. But I'm going to be using this foundation to spot conceal. I'm not going to apply this all over my face. One, it is super hot here in New Jersey, number one. And number two, I kind of kind of wanted to see how their pressed powder foundation works with um, using it as the actual all over um, complexion. Um, but next I'm going to go in with this eyeshadow again from New Evolution. This is the shade Chic from New Evolution and I'm just going to be applying this all over my lid, all over my eye space in general. And then I'm just going to go in and blend out the edges with the pressed powder just so that it's you know nice and slimmest because that's this is the only shade that I'm going to be using for this particular look. And I'm just using the pressed powder just to, like I said, get rid of the harsh edges and just to make sure it looks nice and blended and seamless so that it's just not like a big old straight line of eyeshadow. It's just kind of blended out into the rest of my eyes. 
And next I'm going to go in with the mascara again from New Evolution. I really, really like this mascara and I love the packaging. It's like super heavy. Like it's not like a lightweight, like I don't know what it's made out of, but it feels super sturdy and just feels super luxurious. Um, so I love the packaging and the actual formula of the mascara is really good. I just feel like it makes my eyelashes look really, really full um, without having to apply on falsies, which I was not doing for this look. This was kind of like a last minute quick date makeup look I was doing before I left the house. Next, I'm going to go in with the New Evolution Press Powder Foundation. This is in the shade 204. Again, my perfect match. Blends into the skin really, really nice. I just kind of press it in and then slightly buff it out. And it's just, it gave me it gave me some coverage. Like, you guys can see the bottom half of my face and my forehead. Like, it's giving me some coverage. I really, really love how this turned out. Um, it's, it's a really good... If you guys can find your shade, if anything with New Evolution, I would definitely say get the foundation and the pressed powder. They are bomb and I actually use the pressed powder with some of my other foundation and it works really well with those as well. But I really, really love the, the skin products. Like the formula is amazing. I just wish they had more shades, obviously. But if you can find your shade, definitely pick it up because it's the formula of their foundation is just really, really, really nice. touches I'm just gonna go in with my inner tear duct highlight I'm not sure what shade that I use if I can remember I will link it down in the description box um, but this was from like a random palette that I had so I'm just using that to apply my inner tear duct I'm gonna apply my blush and then I'm just going to be lastly it's my lips and I do go in with the lip liner from Mac this is the, the chestnut from Mac I'm gonna apply to line my lips first before I apply my lip gloss and then the lip gloss I'm going to use again from New Evolution this is the shade Fig and I'm just going to apply that I love this shade I feel like this is a really good everyday lip gloss not sticky gives you a slight tint of color kind of matches the eyes as well but I really really love their lip glosses it came out super pretty super simple fast makeup look for a quick date night I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup look and I will see you guys next time I will have a list of all the products that I linked down in the description box for you guys if you want to check them out and yeah I will see you guys in the next video bye guys